So I picked up Sean. We're just gonna leave the truck down at the yard and we bought groceries, so that's a grocery haul coming up. Caroline, bum, bum, bum. Good times <laughs> never been so good. So good, so good, so good. And I asked him if I could have an Easter donut from uh, Tim Hortons. They put it in the Tim Bits box. And he got the Dutchie. Is that what they're called? Apple fritter. Oh, sorry. An apple fritter is what he got. But look at that. I'm excited to jump into it. You just want the chocolate eggs. I just want the chocolate eggs. Yep. <laughs> no, but I love the donut too. We are headed home. Look at the beautiful sky. It is zero degrees. I just heard on the radio though that tomorrow, Good Friday, we're getting um, up to 10 centimeters of snow. Seriously. But we'll see what happens. We'll keep you posted. John's working on taking all the groceries out. He's put some up here. And I have two nosy dogs. Jimson and Kerrygold. It's RJ. Oh, sorry, RJ. I can never. It's Bob J. They look the alike. Okay, let's get this groceries in so I can do a haul. Yes, dear. So my ice cream doesn't melt. Yes, dear. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to another video. Shh. Max. He's pretty loud for a little guy, isn't he? Yeah, so, um. <laughs> what what are you saying, Max? He's happy to see me. He is happy. Uh, yeah, it is Thursday, and Sean had loaded the trailer, and it was going to Pennsylvania, and it doesn't deliver until, did you say Thursday? The 4th. Until April 4th, so he would have just been sitting down in the States over, over Easter, um so he parked the truck and trailer at the yard and i went down and picked him up and we picked up a few groceries which is good and i'm not taking that trailer now and now he's not taking the trailer he'll get a different load when he goes back <laughs> oh right because you you're going to go back to work tuesday That's right. and then it wouldn't be enough time to deliver it anyway somebody else is going to continue on with it well it would be we got the bruise rocket yeah look at your hairdo Awesome, isn't it? Oh my goodness, people. Anyway, I hope everyone is doing well. <laughs> <laughs> and that is her ready for Easter. So I'm happy that Sean's going to be home now for the weekend <laughs> until Tuesday. Yes. And uh, we were invited out for dinner on Sunday, but I had already declined because I knew he was going on this load. But he actually, I think we're just going to stay home and have a nice quiet Easter, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to be out driving, like when you drive for a living, you don't want to be out driving on your days off, if that makes sense. So I totally understand where he's coming from. So we're just going to have a chill, laid back Easter with the animals. Yeah, so I picked up some groceries because we needed a few groceries. And uh, I'm going to start off with the co-op store. And then, so we went to the co-op grocery store, which is... A Manitoba thing and we went to Sobeys so I need my glasses on when I was in Sobeys I forgot to go look at the flower and that's why we ended up stopping at the co-op store <laughs> all right so at the co-op store I grabbed two pounds of carrots for three dollars and 49 cents from Canada U.S. Product of USA. All right, we'll put those there. I grabbed uh, bacon. It was kind of pricey, five ninety nine. It says hardwood smoked, and it's a product in Western Canada. It's a three seventy five mil, so five ninety nine. Just so we can have some bacon Saturday and Sunday, because we didn't. We need to get to Costco soon. Uh, oh, I didn't realize that these were organic mushrooms. Oh. I like them. I like the little ones. So does that mean they weren't grown with uh, organic manure? I don't know. Anyways, um, they're from Canada. No, they're not. That one oh, yeah, right there. Canada, yeah. Uh, $3.99 because we needed more mushrooms. And sour cream. Because the sour cream, um, 
was quite pricey in Sobeys, so I priced it here and it was on special for $2.99 for a big one. So that's what we got. And Sean grabbed it, so I don't know if he checked the date on it. May 2nd. Oh, oh, right there, yeah. May 2nd, yep, 24th. So we bought sour cream. Ugh. Yeah, this is what we bought when we just ran in to price the flour. Um, I got me another lemon, 99 cents, and I see that it's got a bit of a bruise, but that's okay. It's just for to throw in my water. Makes me drink water. 99 cents. Uh, the potatoes were on sale, uh, the reds or the russets, and I still have a basket full of red in the fridge. So we went with russets because I like the russets. They are a good mashed potato, uh, potato, and they're good for, um, like in a stew, mashed potatoes, whatever. So anyway, that's what we bought. A 10 pound bag was $9.99. So a dollar a pound. Here you go, I'm getting some French fries. I'll hold my puppy and my puppy. I'll hold my little boys. And you can hold those up. <laughs> so yeah, $9.99. Sean got some more coffee. Did you make sure it wasn't that decaf? Oh, yes, yeah, it's a different <laughs> color blue. Oh, my goodness. French roast yeah. he got. Peacock blue is decaf. And this is from Canada, and uh, it says, roasted in Canada. I don't drink coffee. That's it. Ten forty nine for his coffee. That's right. I'll keep the decaf for I want to guess. Now, we were looking at, uh, is it Robin Hood, the flower? I believe so, yeah. The name brand, and it was marked down, but the co-op one was even cheaper. So I got me two big 10 kg bags. This one is just whole wheat. It was $13.98. You gonna hold it up? Which one are you doing first? The whole wheat. They're both the same price, actually. Yep. $13.98, because I do have a whole wheat starter going on the sourdough. Okay, thank you, put it down. And then I got a white. Now, when you're doing the sourdough in white, you have to use um, unbleached. So unbleached white. So now I got lots of flour. I'll get one ready so I can bake a, a whole wheat and a white one tomorrow. The uh, Robin Hood mm -hmm. five kilogram bag was fifteen forty nine. Oh wow! I'm just gonna grab his stroller. Fifteen forty nine. Yep. It was only two dollars more then. And was it a kg? Ten kg? Five. Oh, it was five. only half the size. Five. I watch my prices, so I even do. the two, the the two point fivers were five ninety nine each, which we were looking at originally until we spotted these. I think you need to visit a barber. What? Oh, <laughs> there we go. There you go. <laughs> Oh my. It's windy in here. All right, so that was the <laughs> co op. So we spent $65.89 in there. And I only ran in for the flour. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. We're going to put these Sobeys items here on the counter. I thought my glasses were crooked, but maybe you guys are. No, it says that. Um, I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'll be back. All right, we are back. Uh, so the Sobeys, um, we did a Sobeys haul last week, I think, because I know I sent Sean in to get uh, dog food for RJ and Jameson. Well, now it's uh, time to buy puppy food for Carrie Gold. So her bag of food that he already put away was $22.99. And I was looking for the Cadbury's uh, milk chocolate eggs. They didn't have them, they had these ones, but these ones, are these Hershey's? Uh, no, they're the compliments ones. These were $9.99, which was a really good price. It said save $4, so they were marked down. So I was happy about that. Yeah, first. Well, I'm going down my list. Then I got mayonnaise, and I always like the one with the olive oil. I just went with their compliments one. It was uh, five forty nine, and we earned a hundred and fifty scene points. Sean wanted ranch dressing because we didn't have any left. 
and he just got the compliments regular one and it was 3.49 I just grabbed another can of diced tomatoes because I only have one left in my pantry and uh, you can make lots of meals with these. So these are just the compliments diced tomatoes with Italian seasoning made with 100% Canadian tomatoes. And I always buy this size, the big, uh, I don't know what size it is. Do you know what size it is? 7.96 mil. I put those in if I'm making lasagna, if I'm making chili, you know, whatever, I buy those. Uh, the brown gravies now, I should have grabbed them last week when I was in Sobeys because they were 66 cents. Today I paid $1.25 each. So I bought two more brown, I believe, yeah, two brown. And I grabbed two turkey because I wasn't sure if I had turkey or not. I will make homemade gravy, but I do add that in to thicken it up a bit more. They're going in the cupboard here. Um, gravy, gravy, gravy. A uh, jug of milk. I got about half a jug left, so Sean's home for four days. Then I grabbed a full, a, a new one. Five fifty nine. Saves me from going to the neighbors and milking the cow. <laughs> uh, so we, their receipts are funny because it'll tell you the price by how much you saved. Uh, ice cream we bought. So I have not tried this creamery one yet, I don't think, from Chapman's. Chapman's is a Canadian company, ice cream company. Let me know if any of you have tried this creamery. Real cream, always fresh. We like uh, the mint chocolate. So we got that one. And ooh, we paid $4.99. And the other one we chose was, what was it? Maple Crunch. Maple Crunch. And I have the Tupperware containers that these, because they're in a box, right? They fit right inside those once, once I open them. I'll show you those, actually, because they're just down here. Just right down here. I've had these for years, oh my goodness. So this is the Tupperware that they fit into with the purple lids. So that's what the ice cream we're going to stay fresh. Okay, back to my receipt. Oh, oh I think I did show you the grocery haul. That's right, because we were talking about the fish last week. I bought some Frozen broccoli, $2.99. The Green Giant one, $2.99. They were all on sale. They have these good till July 2025. And then I bought the California mix. That is, uh, I believe, their store brand. Best Buy Value Plus. 750 gram, but I mean, it's half the bag. Well, no, it's just a quarter. So three quarters of the bag full is what I'm trying to tell you. $2.99 for these, $2.99 for California mix. And I did buy sliced carrots, $2.49. I don't know why I did this because I've got a whole bag full of carrots from our garden still in the freezer. We'll eat them. Frozen carrots, $2.99. We got 150 points for those. We bought our fruit tray because we'll make like breakfast in the morning and we sit this out and we enjoy some fruit with breakfast in the morning. $12.99. I see they didn't put blueberries in this one either. Lots of watermelon though. Yeah. Why does it say you saved 98 cents? But I think we still paid the $12.99. And... I have a ham in the freezer, which I was going to cook for Easter, but I was looking at the turkeys and this is a fresh turkey and it was only $17.50 and I thought, yes, I will buy this because it, this is all we need, the size of a turkey for $17.50. Look at that. Well, the size of a chicken. I, well, no, it's not. It's bigger. 
So I'm going to cook this and possibly the ham as well. But then I'll have, you'll have turkey for sandwiches. We'll have turkey for soup. We'll have turkey. We have cranberry. I hope we do. That's what I was looking for and I didn't see them. Well, whatever. Five to eight kilograms. Five to eight kgs. So five to eight. Oh my goodness, this is the size in the middle. Five to eight. So it's between a 12 and 22 pounds, but it's not 22 pounds. No. That was a really good buy. And I think we can just leave it in the fridge. Yeah, I'm not gonna freeze it because it's fresh. That was good. The frozen ones were a lot more, even the little ones at that size. Because at first we were going to get the one in the box thinking out oh, it's just the two of us. But when I saw that, I took that one for sure. Seven. Oh, and it said you saved nine oh nine, So it was over $20 regular price. And we bought more fish because if you remember the fish I showed you last week, there was only five pieces in it. I cooked four for dinner. So there was one left for me, which I wanted to eat tomorrow on Good Friday. And uh, now that Sean's home, we grabbed some more. This is Jane's and it's beer battered haddock, uncooked beer uh, be, blah, 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 by Alexander Keith, <laughs> fine beers. <laughs> you would think I already had a beer or something. That's a big, big East Coast beer. So I just want to open this just to see how many pieces we have. Oh. This is good till January, 2025, wow. We're just, you know, that last one had five pieces in it for $8.99. What did I pay for this? $10.99, instant savings, $2. Well, there you go, there's a lot more in this one. There is two, four, six, seven pieces. Not bad, they're all big ones too. There you go, so that's left of the old one, and that one, that's two and Fridays. Well, exactly. My grandfather too, oh, Friday, in Ireland, Fridays was always fish, fish and chips night. So I like to continue that. Uh, oh, and I wanted an apple pie. This uh, little one, I believe it's seven inch, eight inch. That's something in my eye. Uh, so $7.99 for that little apple pie. Sean goes, look, there's half an apple pie. And I says, no, I want a whole one. <laughs> so yeah, apple pie. Now, did I get everything? I did. So our total in Sobeys, we earned 10 points. That's scene points, if you have a scenes card. Uh, with taxes, $126.78. But just remember that there was a big bag of dog food in that too. So we did really well at Sobeys for what we got. 126.78. So that is it. Um, oh, you did the pie? I did the pie. You can sit it in the fridge even, yeah. So I also went to into Dollarama for something specific, but they didn't have it. I'll check the other store. We're going out on Tuesday. And I'll check the other store to see if they have one. And uh, what else? I'm just looking at the table. Oh, and I went to the thrift store. So I'll put that thrift store and Dollarama together for another video. Yes, so if you are going traveling um, to stay with family for the weekend, be safe out on the roads and uh, enjoy your Easter weekend. Yes, can't believe it's Easter because I'm looking outside at the snow. And uh, the radio station was saying that we're expecting up to 10 centimeters of snow tomorrow. So another reason why we're just going to stay home. Yeah, let Sean rest and be ready to go back on the road because he's going to have to work hard all of April. Yes, to get us back on our feet again after he hit that moose in, it was actually October 1st. So October, November, December, January, February, March. We're going six months now that we've had to uh, put out a lot of money to get that truck back on the road. So hopefully all is good now. Right, Max? Hey, do you want to come up and say bye? Say a happy Easter. 
Mom's happy because she's got her Easter eggs. Yay! <laughs> Maybe that'll be a good thumbnail. Hey, do you want to be on my thumbnail today? Yeah. I'm getting kisses. All right, so I will put those other videos out over the weekend because I know not everybody is going to have a busy weekend. So you'll have a $2 Amas because I already recorded one, but I need to edit it and uh, I'll record this one as well. So yes, you will get a couple of videos over the weekend. Like I said, have a safe and happy Easter and I will catch us all on my next video. Bye for now. Say bye, Sean. I think it's in the bathroom. Sean. He's in the bathroom. I'll say bye for him. All right, I'll catch you on the next one. Take care. Hey, Caroline. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Good times <laughs> never been so good. So good. So good. So good.